Casa Liz Fitness 10 minute workout. Today we have a 10 minute standing stretch. It's great for anyone that is working from home right now, or I mean, even if you're in the office, we are going to loosen up those hips. We're going to incorporate the upper body. We're going to work everything that gets so tight while you're sitting and working all day long. So 10 minutes are on the clock. Let's get into it. Here we go, pressing start. So my chair here is to emulate a desk chair or if you have your desk, you can do that too. We are going to start with a standing right quad stretch. So I want your left hand on the desk or the chair and your right hand on the ankle of your right foot. So what you're going to do here is think about pushing that knee down towards the ground and the hips forward to really open up that hip flexor right there. Feeling that in the quad, all the way down the front of the leg, holding onto the desk if you need it. Otherwise, hand on the hip to hold that balance. And we're gonna hold it here for another 10 seconds, pushing that knee towards the ground, really feeling that in that hip. Stand up tall, relax the shoulders. In three, two, one, let's switch sides. Holding on to that left ankle and the right hand on the chair or the desk. Pushing the hips forward, knee down towards the ground. Good job. So it takes about 30 seconds to 60 seconds to really release the muscle when you're stretching. So sometimes it feels a little bit boring when you have to stretch because you do have to hold things for a long time. You can't just fly through it in order to let that muscle release. Good, let's stand here for three, two, and one. Good. Shake that out, let's do a standing figure four. So holding on with your right hand, right ankle on the left, right above the left knee, and sit down, full feeling that in the outer of the right leg. Good, chest is up, and breathe. Good, abs are engaged. Just getting out of that chair feels good sometimes. Moving your body, intentionally stretching, awesome. Let's straighten that left leg, grab onto the right ankle, stand up and support right underneath that knee on the right leg, a standing figure four here. Good. Nice work, incorporating that inner thigh. If you need to let go with that right hand, hold onto the chair for balance, please do so. And breathe, relax. Good. And three. Two, one, let's switch to that other side. I'm gonna move my chair. You'll be seeing me move this chair quite a bit. All right, we've got the left leg over the right and sitting down into that squatting figure four. Chest is open. We're taking deep breaths here. We're stepping away, releasing our mind of everything we're doing at work today, everything we're doing with the kids. If you'd like to give yourself a little ankle roll. Forward and back. This are 10 minutes for you to reset and realign with your day. Let's stand up with that right leg nice and safe, holding on underneath that ankle, holding on underneath that knee. Good. I am almost 19 weeks pregnant right now, so this stretch feels so good in my hips. Really nice. Release the legs, shake them out. Good job, let's take that right arm, cross it in front of the chest. We're gonna take that left one right above the elbow, push the right shoulder down, oh, and bend the head over to the left, feeling it in the neck, the shoulder, everywhere you probably tense up during the day. And breathe. Good, feeling that all the way down the tricep. Shake it out and take that same right hand, put it behind the back and grab it with the left hand here and pull. So you're crossing your arm behind your back. And what you're going to do is put your head over to the left and feel that all the way down your neck, into those traps, into the shoulder, and then go to the other side. Go point that head towards the right. Nice 
job. All right, shake it out. Let's cross that left arm over the chest, same thing. Right arm right above that elbow, and then actively push down that left shoulder. Good. Standing up tall here, and breathing deeply. We call them 360 breaths it's in the nose and out the mouth. Good. For four, three, two, one, and that left arm behind the back, pulling over with the right. And we're going to tilt our head over to the right, feeling it all the way down that left side neck, into the trap, into the shoulder. And then head over to the left. All right, in three, two, one. Give me some calf raises here. Warming up that lower body after sitting all day long. Good, for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, core tight, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, let's shoot that right leg out, toes pointing up. Can you touch your toes here? Feel it all down that hamstring and into the calf. Back is flat. Head, neck, shoulders in a line. Hang on to that trunk chair if you need to. Otherwise, just rest that hand nicely on the left leg. Good. And let's switch. Good job. If you can't touch the toes, just hand nicely on the shin or above the knee, anything where you can feel that stretch. Good, in three, two, one. Stand it up, we're gonna do some standing hip openers. I want you to stand, lift your right leg into a 90 degree position, up to the side and down, and the left and down, good. Just working on mobilizing the hips here, getting them active, Getting those glutes involved, alternating side to side. Core is working here. Stabilization muscles are working here. Good. And breathe. If you need to, hang on to the chair. Extra stability. Good. One more each side. Right and left. We're gonna do some lunge repeaters to open up the hips here. So we're gonna have the right leg forward and the left leg back. I want you to lean into that right leg, feeling it down the left side here. Holy moly, holy moly. And push it back and down again. Breathe, push it back, down again. Good, push it back, down again. Oh my goodness, feeling it in that glute, really opening up that hip, good. Standing up nice and safe, use the chair if you need to, and left leg forward, right back, leg back. Lean into that left leg and feeling it all the way down the right. Good, push it back and forward. Good, back and forward. Back and forward. Good, one more, back and forward. Good, standing up straight here. All right, let's start with the left leg over the right. Cross the feet, left arm up nice and tall, and lean over to the right. Side body stretch, hip stretch, everything stretch. Good. Open up that heart, open up that chest, and breathe. Good, other side, right leg over the left, right arm goes up, nice and tall, lean over to the left, oh, I feel it in this side, good. All right, here we go, we've got 30 seconds left. In this practice, we're going to roll our head and our neck and our shoulders. The last 30 seconds, join me now. 
Make sure you're switching directions. Make sure you're releasing the tension and you are breathing deeply. This is the end. Your body should be tingling and releasing all those tight muscles. Good. 10 seconds left here. Roll those shoulders forward. Roll them back. In five, four, three, two, and one. There it is, you guys. 10 minutes. You did it. Thank you so much for joining me. If you have any recommendations for 10 minute workouts you would like to see, please email me at info at hustlelizfitness.com or DM me hustle underscore lizfitness on Instagram. Thank you so much. I hope you feel so great after standing up out of that seat and intentionally moving your body. Have a great day.